Reels can be fun to make, but without consistent cover images, reels can quickly and easily make your feed look messy and off-brand. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make reel cover images using Canva so you can create an Instagram feed that consistently matches your brand. Hi, I'm Wonder Belida, a videographer and video coach. I teach and offer video production to educators and digital course creators so that they can film once to teach many. Before you start creating your real cover images in Canva, I suggest you come up with some brand guidelines for yourself. The important thing is that your brand resonates with you and you feel proud sharing it. Start by coming up with a color scheme and a main font. Personally, I like to print my color scheme and brand font to display it close to my desk so I can easily access my color codes. If you're having troubles coming up with a color scheme, start by googling color palettes from your favorite movies, superheroes, or works of art. If you want your colors to have more meaning, you can look up a color emotion or color meaning guide and see which words resonate most with you. A font says a lot about your brand, so you want to pick something that matches the feel you want your brand to represent. If you're still stuck, you can always use one of Canva's trending style guides. To access them, go to the Styles tab and simply pick one that resonates with the look and feel of your product or service you are ready to start designing your template. You have two options when starting. You can either find a template and update it to match your branding, or you can start from scratch. Start by going to create a design and type in your custom size. For an Instagram real cover, dimensions are 720 pixels wide by 1280 pixels high. We want to start by adding a guide, which is going to show you which parts of your real cover image will appear in the feed. To do so, go to elements and type in square. You want to choose a border with a thin outline and a hollow center. Expand the square so it fills the frame and make sure that it's centered. You will know when it's centered when you see the pink line going horizontally across the square. Everything inside the square will show up in your Instagram feed, while everything outside of the square will only show up when somebody sees the cover in your Instagram's Reels tab. Now it's the fun part, it's time to create your design. Start by adding your brand colors. Canva makes this really easy for you by allowing you to save your palettes so you can easily access them. Next, you want to add any texture or background images that represent your brand. Do this by clicking elements and searching for patterns. I personally love lightning bolts, so I'm going to search for some lightning bolt patterns. Once you find something you like, it's easy to add it to your canvas. To get your pattern to match your brand, adjust the color of it. Personally, I like mine to blend with the background, so I like to reduce the transparency of the pattern. Next, you can add an image to your template. I like adding images of me because I find that they tend to perform better. To add images, go to uploads. In Uploads, you will have the option to upload media or use images in your current library. With my Reels, I like my background color to show, so I make sure that my image does not fill the square. You can change the dimensions of your image by moving the lines on the sides of your image. Once you like the positioning of your image, you can crop your image by clicking on the image and then moving the image. Click on the text tab and add a heading and your text will appear in the canvas. You want to make sure that your font is adjusted to match your branding. Once you are happy with your design, you can remove the square border or leave it if it's something that you like. You want to download the JPEG and send it to your phone or better yet, access Canva from your phone and download it there. Once the cover image is on your phone, all you have to do is click cover, then add from camera roll and add your custom image to your Instagram reel. Now that you know how I create my Instagram Reel covers using Canva, you too can create branded Reel covers that will make your feed look professional. Thank you for watching my video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, or better yet, leave me a comment. I have new videos to help educators and digital course creators with video production each and every Wednesday. Until next time, peace!